I mean, he, uh, he can try me again any time I, I was out, so, uh, yeah, I'm back now. Okay, all right. He's in an awkward place where Manahi is. He's um, recording. Yep. He's um, stuck out in the uh, outside um, Kai Taya. Kai Taya or Kai Kohi? Kai Kohi. Um, and very difficult to get a reception there on mobile phone. So we'll just um, leave it there and wait for him to call me back again. I don't like it when I miss a call, but that'll do for now. Um, I'll, I'll, I'll just, um, while I'm waiting, um, I'll just, um, no, what I'll do it later, I was going to show you what I'm doing online, sending um, email, uh, well I might as well, while I'm here, while he's not there yet, um, I can break off as soon as he calls. I want to show you what I've been doing this morning, sending the um, um, emails to the, um, the Paramount Chiefs on my site. I'll put it on full screen. Uh, well, I'm, I'm just going to show you what I do. It's a, a big job to um, make the um, court, the magistrate court, line up with the um, chiefs. They're live. So here we have the um, uh, Manahi. He's just waiting for him. Uh, I'm writing to him and the rest of the chiefs and our crew in um, uh, Britain and also in Canada. We've got the natives waiting for us there. So I'll show you uh, the pages. The seals of New Zealand are there. They, they state this in WikiLeaks, that that's their seal there in 1841 there. And this one in, um, that's 1841, the bottom one. Uh, this top one, one is 1841, and the other one is 1852 here. 1852, put a gap over there. 1852 seal there. So now you can see, and uh, here I have our one here of King William. Now you co couldn't get any better than that with him on his horse there, and his ship of Admiralty in the background. So that means it's on dry land with his horse on the land, and his crown at the top. And his eight point star of King William the uh, Third, and his principalities of the Saint uh, Saint Patrick's Church Order in Belfast. That I'm putting information out to the Paramounts now uh, about uh, this part of the um, seal that we have here at 1834, 20th of March 1834, when the King gave us um, his. Um, flag here, that you see here, look, and the ship of Admiralty in the Waitangi grounds, that ship mast uh, with the f three flags flying on it, that's that's our authority as the Crown um, um, land patent rights to the um, um, cuboid title, that's to the centre of the earth and to the heavens, and right out around, we went out to 500 miles around New Zealand. So that's our title there that the Paramount Chiefs and um, uh, uh, hold in the Magistrate Court uh, in Waitangi Marae and Titi Marae and Te Hapua at Te Hikua Te Ika Marae that we're going up there on 18, 19, 20th to reassert our uh, authority again of jurisdiction over this country and over the government here. Now, the mischievous Maoris is the New Zealand Crown Government private corporate ownership patent name brand business threat to the Moai Crown Paramount Commercial Contract Bank Investment Land Birth Certificate Bond Security Instruments Valued Ownership 
King's Inheritance Trust estate business interests. Now they are a threat. The Maori are a threat because it belongs to the Crown Corporation of New Zealand and New South Wales. Now this John Key there, 13 million he gave to Clinton and nothing said about it. See, he's, we're, we're reining him in to the Magistrate Court again up in Te Hapua. We're making a full-blown hapu and Paramount Chiefs equal to the King hearing there. And this is, all these documents are the Magistrate Court itself we're putting together as portable in a briefcase I showed you, the metal briefcase. And that's where this flag should be flying at the top of the mast. It's been flying on the cross rung opposite the British flag as partner ship of Admiralty on this treaty grounds. And we're seizing these lands back into the King's Bench Court. Um, now this is um, Bolwyn. Um, Bowen uh, Act 19, 1846 um, and um, we're using that Bowen Act 1849 um, principalities of King William III of Orange and uh, Bowen comes from Belfast where our, my ancestors come from Cosgroves, the lawyers and um, uh, so we're using that, that's where Theresa May has gone back to Belfast uh, to um, administer this um, jurisdiction of Admiralty of King William III here. Um, so uh, that's our title uh, and our authority coming from him. Principality of Orange there, see that? Principalities of Orange, Zealand, there's New Zealand there, right? William of Orange and a Prince of Orange, Holland um, and um, Dutch, England, Ireland, King of England, Ireland and Scotland uh, from 1689 until his death. Well, his acts we're using from 1650 to 1702. Um, principal, Principality of Orange, King William II was King William III anyway. Um, so there he is again, and I'll just scroll down, and that's Belfast. We're going to Belfast as being our authority, straight there, and Ulster to Ulster, North Island, New Zealand here, and the province of Auckland, stretching from Auckland to Tiki Tiki, East Coast, and St Mary's Church there with this St Patrick's Church Order 8-point star. So um, so we've got right up to the end here in Ulster and I've just got a bit more to put in there and some bits more on the um, 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 Waitangi grounds when we opened up the Magistrate Court there on the 15th of April 2016. Uh, so that's the latest I can show you other than there it is on Facebook. Uh, I'll go back and start and show you on Facebook as it goes down. That was the email that I'm sending to the Paramount Chiefs and our organisation here, Canada and in uh, Britain, uh, Scotland and England. Uh, there are staff there. So it starts off with this uh, history of St Mary's Anglican Church on this, at least this post, Robert Baldwin, that's, he's put that together in Canada. The um, Crown land patents that we're using and the um, and the uh, uh, cuboid title uh, surface title on the land is what you've got cuboid is all that uh, land below to the center of the earth and up to the sky and our title includes the admiralty of the sea up the lakes rivers and valleys of water um, title in maritime law of King William the Third, King William the Fourth, jurisdiction of Admiralty Magistrate Court that we exercise is right here on Facebook as evidence, our evidence to Ernest Augustus, King of Hanover, in um, uh, his time as a brother of King William the Third, uh, King William the Fourth, and uh, King George the Fourth. Uh, this was the other brother, the third brother, 
and with their father, King George III. So those are the four kings that are on our flag in the corner of the little red cross with the black strip around it, which is the Navy military. And so we've got here, we've got Ulster. I'm just showing you on Facebook, this is our uh, uh, fact, um, cite, cited evidence to our court hearings in the Magistrate Court here in Westminster Magistrate Court, straight there. Um, and so we go right down here and all the rest of the city of Westminster, city of London, the difference between the city of London, which is these Rothschilds banks, the city of Westminster is our court of king. Queen here in the city of London, Rothschild banks, and the queen, and the king here, city of Westminster, is our court, the highest court in the world of commerce, the king's commerce, and there's Westminster uh, on the map there, right? That's what I'm saying on this uh, on this video as uh, our evidence. Um, so there's Westminster there, and the hanging rope there of King William the Third and King William the Fourth for tyrants and treason uh, of the Queen uh, Elizabeth the Second has caused treason. Okay, so there's the rest of it. And this man here. Crown land patent and why you need one. Now, here's where the um, cuboid title is explaining this um, crown land patent, which is a king's crown land patent. So he's got his own that the, the principalities of the councils cannot um, um, go and negotiate on his land for any use for their um, taxes, rates, and um, uh, anything they want to make money out of it other than the normal uh, fees that he does pay for the use of the land. He's only there on behalf of the king uh, and our king for that matter. So there's um, Theresa May in a quandary and the DUP party there that's in um, has put a billion pounds into Belfast where I'm saying that's my ancestors come from there and that's where St. Patrick is with the eight point star on our flag uh, of Admiralty Magistrate Court, Court Martial and Financial Martial Law is where she's coming from. So it's a good thing that'll let us in with the flag and clean out the um, um, House of Lords, which is just dead, dead people and wasted money in there. We don't need them when we've got a King Ernest Augustus V uh, to put into uh, Parliament. So it's another good video about Theresa May uh, and uh, what she's um, up against us now in St. Fain here, Northern Ireland. He's the Catholic and she's the Protestant, right? She's representing the Protestants here. Uh, this lady here, um, I can't see what her name is, uh, Arlene Foster. She's re representing the, the, um, the Protestants in uh, Belfast. So. You've got the Catholics in the northern region uh, with Sinn Féin, our, our Jerry Adams, and you've got her and her party there in uh, Belfast. That's our, our own Ulster there to Ulster, New Zealand, North Island, New Zealand, to Northern Ireland as our connection to King William III and King William IV jurisdictions of Admiralty. We're at the top end with our flag, and I've said enough about that. Um, so we go down. Uh, pass there to the signing of that agreement with um, the, the coalition party and us will be the, the other one missing link uh, Act 1846 Act using the Constitution Act so I'm putting all these uh, pieces in here where it's connected around this Baldwin Act 1846 Baldwin Act Crown uh, Land Patents uh, and using don't have any. They, they can't go into that because it's a private contract with us. These are their seals. Uh, the 1841 seal with the Maori chief that's been invented by the Crown New, Zealand, New South Wales government, New, New Zealand company, um, against the Manukau company in Scotland, uh, Edinburgh. And our title is there, the Moriori Manukau title, which is what um, Manahi Parapara Mohini is looking after and administering that on our behalf. And uh, Bundy Waitai is administering the uh, Cook Island title um, and uh, Captain Cook. Uh, so that's the difference between the two. And, and uh, 
Hilwini Klaka, or Selwyn Clark, is representing the British partnership as captain uh, uh, of his British immigrants here, the whole lot of them, uh, being 90 and in the Maori Battalion and all of that war stuff under this flag. Okay, that's our flag there, with the ship of Admiralty on the treaty grounds, Waitangi. We're going to seize the land and seize the ship back into our jurisdiction of Admiralty, trading bank jurisdiction of commerce. We are the commercial land owners according to this citation of a video. Today, on uh, Monday, the 17th of July 2017, I'm making a bold statement here about this seal, our seal, as against this seal. This is 1834 seal. On the 20th of March 1834, the King gave us this flag, the Paramount Chiefs. Not the Iwi Chiefs, the Paramount Native Surname Chiefs. Those are Paramount is from the same surname to the last surname, Parapara to Parapara to Parapara, Manukau to Manukau to Manukau to Manukau to Manukau to Manukau, and Wānau to Wānau to Wānau to Wānau to Wānau, all the way back to Rapa Nui, Easter Island, and the Raiate Island in Tahiti. And then you get Waitai, 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 all the way back to Cook Islands and Captain Cook. Uh, was acknowledged in 1833 by King William IV that uh, this country was founded by Captain James Cook in um, um, 1769 or something around about then and um, um, he confirmed that uh, in 1833 before giving this flag to us in 1834 as the founding document doctrines of discovery title of this country under British rule and under the commercial um, flag of Admiralty under the King's Bench Court Magistrate, uh, not the Australian New Zealand uh, Admiralty uh, second-hand title. And there, Prince Philip has resigned from that position as Commander-in-Chief. We are the Chief Commanders here, talking for our land as jurisdiction over the government and its courts here. And so we go down further uh, with uh, Crown Enabling Hauraki. The Hauraki Maori trying to steal the land and the foreshore and seabeds, but their uh, Crown has come out with their uh, Takutai Moana. They got rid of the 2004 Helen Clark um, Foreshore and Seabed Act. See, they just flicked it out and put 2011 Takutai Moana Act to replace that, just like that, at the whim put another new act in to keep their thing rolling in fraud and corruption. We're going after them with that. Prime Minister John Key Court channeling millions of dollars of taxpayers' money to Hillary Clinton. Okay, so there they are, New Zealand's largest grab at the beach near you. So Attorney General Chris Finlayson, he's up to no good again after getting rid of the 2004 Foreshore and Seabed Act. We went through a whole heap of trouble and now he's just ditched that and got this Takutai Moana bill with these crooked Maoris and trying to have another crack at the um, uh, Crown land patents uh, around the corner. Uh, trick through America and the Queen, the fraudulent Queen, we're having up for treason and John Key and the rest of the Parliament have got, got a bounty on the head now from the Magistrate Court here. As you can see, we opened up the Waitangi Marae. I'll show you a little bit of it. As being the uh, Waitangi Marae King's Bench Native Grand Jury Trial Magistrate Court. So this is official, people. We opened it. all these carvings here. Those are my ancestors. We're Taha in Tiki Tiki, St. Mary's Church there. Oh, dear. Yeah, well, when we say that, it means it's official. When we say that, it means the chiefs here passed our laws and acts we had on Titi Marae in this Marae as our jurisdiction. And my carvings are in this Marae as my title, my own uh, Tahitian royal family titles inside this Marae. And that's what Kingi says, it belongs to me. Okay, so that's, I'm just telling you a true story about whose
carvings these are and whose Maui statue. Those are our statues and around the world that the, the, the Crown Corporation King and Queen put them there as a memorial to our title. Uh, okay, so that's, that's that. Um, just letting you know that we, we did open that marae up and we're going back to seize the land and the marae and that flag of Admiralty right there, sitting just beside that marae as the ship on dry land. This flag was given on dry land and his horse on dry land with his ship in the background there on this seal, right? And he's crowned, King William IV's crown and his eight-point star of St. Patrick's order as Sheriff's Badge, okay? What's that coming? It can seize your land under the principalities of King William III uh, in um, um, Belfast, um, uh, Downpatrick uh, County. Okay, so that's um, the chief speaking uh, to our uh, documents that I'm saying here and all these um, uh, evidence. And he wanted his land back and said this is the only way to get land back. So this is another video on, on uh, Russell. Uh, at uh, Kururareka, where the, the Navy first came in and put their flag up, British flag, on the 20th of March, 1834. Now, that's this title here, there. This flag was, this mast and the British ship went first up on this hill at Kururareka, on top of the Mikey Hill, and we raised the flag up to the top of this flag ship. Mass. Okay, so just telling you uh, that um, I want you to watch this. There, I want you to watch this. Well, I just check my phone to see. Oh. From the heavens to the center. Oh. There's Jim Tupi Wikotu, Matatu Waka from Potiki in the East Cape. I'll just, I'll just call mine in here in a minute. So there we are, I'm just making statements there, that that's our flag right there, this one here I just showed you flying up the top of that ship. Um, <coughs> at the Okiato um, Native Court, that um, on the 20th of March 1834, the British gave us that flag flying on that mast. Just one more little bit. This is where we started off. See, it's gone upside down with this stress to the British, right? That we ran out of time with um, 
the justice system here is that corrupt that we, we couldn't go any further. It was Jim that put the flag upside down on the flag staff ship. Our lands will be returned to us, and that's what's happening right now. Tried to reach the New Zealand Navy, they just ignored us. So we ran out of patience with them. We're going straight. <coughs> so there we uh, have it. Straight I'm to just, Britain. Just uh, um, expressing uh, to the people who are watching uh, proceedings of raising of our Confederation flag. That's the 1835 Declaration of Independence flag, sovereign authority and jurisdiction, founding uh, documents of this country, New Zealand. So there we go. Oh, that's all I want to show you, a little bit of that. I'm going to ring Manahi now, and um, I'll leave this um, video running, and I'll put it back over here. Sorry, my place is a bit of a mess. I, I had a bit of, bit of a rummage around and made a big mess. I've got to clean it up. And I've got to bring him back. Hopefully... He would have gone outside where the reception is best. Bit cool this morning. Get a money. Get a money. Are you cold? Are you out in the cold? Oh, okay, that's right. The sun is breaking through. Oh, okay, I won't talk too long. Um, I'm going to email some more things shortly, but those are just um, the, the bits that go into your file uh, yeah. with us connecting to Belfast. And, uh, and that part of the King William III, this is this uh, to make, uh, make it more of authority of who we get our authority from. And, and, and that, that part's got to go together when I put the last bit of the, of the um, Crown Land patent together. And, and that'll, be, that'll be your brief case. That's all you need is this, what I put on Facebook and on YouTube uh, last night and yesterday. It's now, it's now public and all, 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 everybody's watching it. Everybody's fixed. On what I'm putting online, and I've just pulled them out, pulled those uh, pieces out that connects the dots uh, in yes. chronology right to the point of the two kings on why the Westminster government is on in trouble now, and we'll step right in right at the right time uh, yes. with the flag to. Tell them we are the missing link, right? We are the missing. We are the missing link because they've got nowhere to turn to, and um, and um, uh, they've got the DUP party in, and they've put the money into Belfast, where the eight point stars of our flag is. You see, it's, it's all adding up. So that's all I am ringing for to let you know that uh, that's your job more so on the birth certificate part in that uh, in that whole process. Uh, so you've got a you've got a your work cut out. <laughs> yeah, uh, I still have to do 
Yeah, yeah, that, that part's right, but it's getting the filing, your little briefcase, all those soft, uh, like what those soft back um, leather uh, uh, brief things that the, some of the magistrates, lawyers, take into the court. They've got a whole bundle of, of stuff. When the wine box that you see them carrying their big thing into the court, that's who they are, the magistrates. They take all the action, you see, and they just pull yeah. it straight out and, and do the court hearing rather than put it off to another day. They'll just do it in one day. So I'll yeah, just have yeah. all that, all that, most of that stuff, I'm emailing to you in a minute. I've finished, I've finished it all now. So you can see it making sense, linking up to the... It is. Yeah, it's making, it, it was there all along, but uh, the British, it was never going to happen until the eighth hour now when there was nowhere else to turn. It would have been too hard for us to try and battle them while they were, while they were full steam. They're running out of steam in Britain. They're running right out of steam and they can't get out of it. They can't get out of trouble because they haven't got any authority. The Queen has jumped ship and left them, left them to fend for themselves. <laughs> she, she's even said bye-bye Maori. And so I don't need her anymore because she's got the money out of it. You see, she's got the money out of it. When we go to HM Treasury, there might not be anything there, so we just tell the British military to go and get it. Yeah. Yeah, so it's just a formality and a, a book entry uh, um, um, transaction. That's, that's all it is. It's, it's, it's got to go through a process, through, back through the court. Where it, where it came here in the first place. You just follow the ship backwards. And <laughs> that's all we're doing, follow the ship where it came from, where it went to and where it came from. And where it's got to now, it's in a big mess now, so we're going to rescue the ship with the flag. <laughs> so I think, uh, I think Bundy would, uh, would tend to put uh, some sort of document together, because he's, he's got a territorial uh, document to take the whole country, and you know what, Tuku, Tuku, uh, is it Tuku Morgan? Is, uh, is uh, oh no, Manu, Manu Paul. He's doing the same thing. He's going after. He's, he's gone. They're going. You have a look on these documents I give you. They're the, uh, Chris Fellerson got rid of the 2004 Foreshore Seabed Act, come out with the Takutai Mona 2011 Act, and it was this year that they ended the submissions to to put your claim in, like what we're doing, put your claim in, but we're not going down that track. We're telling them, where did you get that from? <laughs> they, they, they're going back around the corner to this Crown uh, land patent to dish out to dish out the, the, the use of the land uh, for you to develop the new land in the sea. You see, they want you to go and spend your labour, to go and yeah. dig it up and make you work to get it, then take it from you. Wow. So we're saying, that's what I'm just telling you right now. I've just put this together last night and yesterday on what they were doing with the Tucky Time on because I've been a foreshore seabed man all the way through. Right from the 2008 when they, well, 2004 and before that, and then when it, when it came to the 2008, that's when the Queen signed the Lisbon Treaty with... Um, Gordon, Gordon Brown from Scotland. That's why Scots are left out of this altogether now. The, the, the government and uh, Theresa May has kicked the Scots out and gone with the Irish. That's us. She's gone with the Irish and that's why the first um, Prime Minister of, of Scotland um, 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 has, is left out in the cold. She, she wonders why she, she's left out and only going after Ireland uh, to, to prop them up. You see, so that's brought us right into the picture with our flag right there at Belfast. Yeah, so that's how we connect there. Um, my Cosgroves come from there. I've just got someone uh, who've made me a friend now, our family there in, 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 in Ireland, in, in um, uh, Down Patrick, right where, right where he's buried, St. Patrick's buried with the eight-point star on our flag. That's our title. That we've got a number of titles running here. <laughs> you add them up. There's a Maui statue. There's a carving in in, in the in the uh, 
uh, Waitangi Marae, that's our Kavi from our, 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 our Tiki Tiki. There's our church title. There's our uh, St. Mary's church title. We've got plenty of titles. <laughs> they got nothing, just women. And I can't get over how they just ditched the 2004 um, um, Full Source Seabed Act. Uh, after we went through a whole heap of trouble, they just said, oh, kick it out and put another one in. You see, all our trouble we went through, now, now we've got to fight, the marriage has got to fight again against the Takatai Bill. And they say, you, you can take, you, if you can prove you've been there since two, uh, 1840, then we'll give you our title. And you've got to go and buy their title, it'll cost you 200 bucks to just go, and get, get, go, go in and get a spell. Huh? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah to, 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 I've got that, I've sent that to you as well, the, the email shortly, in about 10 minutes or so. And it's got that Takatai bill there with everything stuck to our court hearing up in Te Hapua. <laughs> we're going we're gonna to knock them out with a Baldwin Act, 1846 Baldwin Act, and the, the New Zealand Constitution Act, I've got it there, 1846, see? They've gone and sidelined it and they've gone around the back door. And they've, oh. using, they, they've been using that act, that, that Crown Land uh, Patent Act, but not tell anybody. That not tell anybody how they they work their principalities. That means the council collecting rates and 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 all that sort of thing. Um, they can't prove uh, who gave them authority to do it. See, see, because they borrowed everything from Australia. You can't borrow another sovereign's authority. And they got no sovereignty authority because there's no queen head of state. All those things they're gone. When, when we do the court hearing up in Tiapa. Up here, yeah. we, we, we'll just finish it in a flash, and, and there's nothing they can do about it because it's jurisdiction. That's it. Juris, yeah. you have jurisdiction and plenty of things to go with it. Yeah, we got we got the documents, the legal documents to 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 take them out uh, or or limit them. The thing is to limit them what they can do. Uh, so what I'm doing uh, before I come up. I'm going to calculate, right, calculate the land area, mass, the population, and how much each person's worth. <laughs> I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to tell you the figures and you'll blow, get blown out of the, the water on how much you're actually worth on your birth certificate, how much the land's worth, how much you're expected to get in your mobile phone, in your, in your bank account, uh, and, and stretched out by week, by week, by week, by week, forevermore, to the centre of the earth and the heavens, <laughs> wrapped up in a five pound note. You see? So, so, so really, um, it's, it's uh, looking clearer and more defined, uh, defined who we are. We, 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 are, we are the backbone of the world. Everything was made on from the Maori, or that's what they say, but from the natives. Um, uh, like Winston Peters was saying, the, the Maori own a third of the globe. They're saying Maori. Now he wants to kick Maori out. Right? Oh, yes, yes, Winston, Winston yeah. wants to get rid of the Maori seats. And, uh, the, uh, oh, but he's really saying they should come out honestly and say, oh, it was, it was a nullity in the first place, uh, 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 the Maori this and that. But they played along with it. They were all liable themselves in it by making use of it. Uh, the Turia Fenua Act and all of that, they made it up. The Crown made everything up. And, 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 and the oath of office of the Scots Freemasons is we are information gatherers. What you give us, we put titles on. We just say, well, the information was wrong, wasn't it? You see? And that makes that invalid. And so the more we talk, the more they're, they're going to scream uh, and go and run and, and hide under a rock, under a rock somewhere. <laughs> yeah, I saw Peter Brown and Polonia with him, you know. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, but they've hooked all everybody in, and 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 now with the yeah. war, war, war um, uh, celebrations, they're trying to make their documents look real. Right? Yeah. And they're standing right in the road. We have to go straight there and tell them that. Your, your jurisdiction has to match ours and, and that will catch them out. That's the hui we'll have at the Popo when we, when we come back from up north 
but uh, I'm hoping that we can do a move straight through to Tikitiki and stop in, and, and even in Auckland, uh, I'll book the marae at the Te Hunga Waka marae at the base of uh, One Tree Hill, because that, that's the right one right there. Um, all the money there will run if we can't get it, but I'll make sure well beforehand that when we come from Te Hapa, we go straight there, and you can stay there. There's enough room in there for everyone to stay there. And then we, we go from there straight down to uh, uh, Rahui Marae. You see? As, as one, one rupu all the way through. So I just, uh, it, it's good that we've got enough time to save up for that before October the 28th, well before then, uh, because the government got their plans. They're reading into what I'm doing and, and they're countering it with some other plan. They're watching what I'm, what I'm writing all the time. And, and, and they're, they're, they're trying to defend themselves. <laughs> but too many people know those Canadians are waiting for me uh, to go there and help them out. And they say, come on, come on, hurry up. Because they can see the ball when that was, was first started in Canada, straight from Britain, straight from Britain, and they're using it um, uh, there, but not here. Because no, 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 nobody knows what to do here with it, because this government has hidden it. They, they've hidden everything so, so that you can't see it, and they play around with Maoris. They can play around with Mary all the time, and everybody blames Mary. You see? They're, they're, really, they're really mischievous uh, to do that, but uh, I think we've got them clobbered this time, and we'll make a clean cut uh, uh, at Waitangi to stop them from doing what they're doing um, with the land. And, and and without the consent from from Westminster, the, the Westminster has to come our way because for them it's revenue. It's, it's revenue for them to recover and, and to prop them up. They wouldn't have to go and go into the EU anymore because that's what Theresa May said. We don't have to go to the World Court. We don't have to because they got the magistrate court made the World, world, world Court. With the, with the King William the third, so they're, they're, they're caught e either way, right? Yes. Yeah, so, so that's uh, the latest. I'm, I'm excited to get back to, to Rahui Marae, and I booked it before. They said, oh, any time you want to just let them know well beforehand, and so I've had to try and make it in September, uh, give enough time, uh, or, or no, August, after Te Hapua, if, if we're rich enough to go back on our cars, yeah, that's the trouble with, with our funding uh, to get there. Well, so I've got to try and work on that uh, somehow to make sure we all get down there. Uh, yeah, yeah, we're going, yeah, we're doing that one when we come down from Te Hapua. We're going to Tunga uh, Waka Marae and stay there and do that one at the same time because. When we do that one, I'm going to march straight into the bank because those power notes are sitting in the bank. They're sitting in the bank and the land underneath it. You see? So, so all of that is going to end up uh, with this jurisdiction thing. That, that's all it's going to be. And um, yeah, so you've got plenty to, 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 to look at and do. But I think you just work on your little briefcase, the portable yes. court, and put these file these in its right place, because yeah. they're one behind the other. I've got them one behind the other, and I've got the videos there for the the Waitangi Marae when we opened yeah. it up, and and the one on on uh, on uh, Okiato, um, up up um, 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 Russell, on on the hill. Oh, I, that, yes. that that that's the 20th of March 1834. That one. That's the first title there. That native court, that native court, and and our all one, uh, and I'm not too bothered about our all one. I'll just go straight into the the bank. The BNZ bank went into Queen Street uh, in Auckland, so we just go straight into the Ungawaka Marae, uh, um, and under the Manukau title. All right. Yeah, and uh, Manukau, that uh, point eight. That, uh, yeah, uh, uh, Pupunga, Pupunga. Pupunga, that's where the Cornwallis, the Cor 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 Cornwallis, uh, that's where that, that um, Simon, Simon, Cor Cornwallis Simon came in. And it's, it's his father and his 
um, Lieutenant uh, William Simon, William Simon from his family that sent him out here, right? With with the with the with the with that Lieutenant with the Twenty Third Regiment in in the Magistrate Court in Scotland, Ed, Edinburgh. That's where that's where those titles came from. The Moriarty titles came from with this other William Simon. To, and then they switched it. They, they got drowned, mysteriously drowned. And then that's when, that's when, um, uh, what's his name? Tamaki and, and Tuaire uh, and uh, Ka, um, Kawa um, took the title for Ngāti Fato, and that's all wrong. I know, I know what happened there, and Kafaru, Kafaru, Hugh Kafaru put his spin on it. And then I brought the Kafaru up from, from Wakatu in, in Nelson. And, and from uh, and brought those those rupu up here up One Tree Hill, and so that's where that's where Mohi was up there with uh, Anaru Mahi and uh, and uh, Owen Paikia. They're, they're from the Kaipara. Those were the apotoros. The three apotoros um, unveiled the Kafaru plaque. I got the Kafaru plaque here. I didn't want to leave it up the hill because they would have uh, destroyed it. The Nazi forces. So the Nazi Fatua can't prove. They can't prove in in front of you three. Paramount Chiefs and me, that they have the king's uh, land patent. They can't prove it. Yeah, because the surnames of Blair is on there. You see Blair. Uh, Blair is, is claiming the Nantifatu a title with all the wrong surnames. You see? They won't listen to it. That's why they're failing with their with their Takutai and Warner bill. And, and Manu Paul, see, Paul, they'll all fail because it says there on those documents I'm sending you that they'll fail when all their submissions go in because they can't prove this title. That's right. They can't. Right. They can't. Yeah. So they're they're really caught out, and they're gonna they're, they're gonna come up against you fellas and me. See, that that's that's just a, a little uh, breakfast corridor. <laughs> that'll keep you going. That'll keep you going for a while. But I'll, 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 the next part of the exercise, I'm on to the figures. I'm on to the uh, the, the the financials, right? Um, you, you'll, 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 you'll get blown out of the sky when you see those ones. <laughs> I'll I'll come out I'll come out clean with it where where all the money's gone. Okay. No other question. No, no. Okay. No. You've been talking to Bundy? No? No, I don't. I haven't got his email or his... Oh, uh, oh okay. Doesn't matter. He knows what he's on his track. You yeah, just stay on, yeah. You just stay on your own track and you're right. Uh, yeah, he'll be on the same page. Yeah, yeah. he is. He is. He, he, he knows his part. But I think he'll be putting together the, the In the Middle of the Earth and, and the Sky title. Um, uh, uh, he'll, he'll see that and he'll jump straight. It's the same as what he did up at Te Hapua with, with, the, with the, um, the, the continental thing around the, around the country. So that, that, that'll be a goer, that, that can go in as well. And we'll just, we'll just make sure that we make the use out of the three days to, to make sure everybody's right up to speed. And a lot of people are watching now on Facebook, they're picking it up from there. Uh, even, even Kahi, even Kahi Harawara is pinching a few words out of there. <laughs> <laughs> I can tell, uh, so I put a little thing there. Oh, there are some people who are clever. I wonder what makes yeah. them clever. <laughs> they will uh, join you come lately, yeah? Yeah, they're, they're, they're picking it up, but the yeah. thing is, they'll know uh, that uh, there was no way to get out of this one. It's too late. It's too late for anyone to try and catch us up. Uh, they, they won't have anything uh, to rub two stones together. Uh, in, in any of the documents, because those documents belong to us in the magistrate. Uh, and, and they go straight into Westminster, no trouble, straight in. And they'll, they'll, be, they'll be watching what we're doing here, because they, they, they need us. They need us for all the native countries in the world comes under this blueprint. That, that's what I mean when I, when I say to Bundy in, in the Hui, this is international. Now, Carla's talking like international, like she knows everything. You see? Yeah, yeah, I but so. but yeah, that, I yeah, because when she says, my hapu approves and lets you go ahead, it's my mana, she says, it's her mana. And I'm thinking, hang on, <coughs> you're, not even, you're, you're not even on the title. I know, I know your father's a Rawadi, right? Her father's a Rawadi oh, on, 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 on the, on the, on the, on the TP3 blocks, on those blocks. I know who's there and who shouldn't be there. 
You see? So, so the Rawari name is not a real, it's not a real native name. No, 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 half, most of the people are around the Bay of Islands and Hokiama, all their names are not real. <coughs> I can tell, and there she is talking, but that's okay, that's fine, she can talk, but the thing is, she did say, go ahead. Right? That, that's all I want to hear. Uh, I, 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 I like what you said, go ahead. That's all I want to hear. I, I, the, yeah, you were there, but the, the thing is, there's not enough Maoris to, to look after everything. So, so you need every Maori, and you need to turn their heads around when yes. they see us doing something, yes. and then they'll have to fall in line. They can't go and jump the queue. No. No, that's what happened. They cut before the horse. And, and, <laughs> and the fellows uh, who are talking it up, and Manu Paul, oh, me and Moe Manika went down to his place in Rotorua, uh, in Whakatane, and, uh, yes. and uh, you know, he's sticking to his guns that he's right. Uh, he's right and we're not right. Uh, and and that's him talking it up with the with the, right. the Maori Council. So now the Maori Council and him put a title around around the whole country. Yeah? I don't know. Where did that come from? He's been reading our stuff, that's why. He's been reading what we're writing. Now all we do is to say, Well, where did you get your authority from? <coughs> you say, Oh Helen Clark or well, where did she get hers from? She's back here now. She back, she's back here to face us in the Force Horse Seabed Act. <coughs> it's all a big scam that they set up to fail Maori. It was set up yeah. to fail Maori because they invented it to fail, to make it the illusion look like we are a tribe, and but they won't say who the author is. You see? Yeah. So, so they'll get caught out. They'll get caught out. They cannot talk paramount chief talk. They can talk Ariki because the Cook Island Ariki and, 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 and the Tahitian Arikis and the uh, Samoan Arikis, they're all being colonized and, and duped. And, and the king of Tonga uh, is under the, the, the thumb of the queen. You see? The, 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 so the Arikis got no cow. They, they only get paid for, for listening to the queen. You see? And the, and the same uh, same with King. He wants to be Ariki. He can be Ariki, but he's, he he was listening to to himself. <coughs> so I just left him. I just left him on the side. But I just found that he's sick. My, my daughter says he's sick. There's something wrong with him. Uh, yeah, it looks like it. Yeah, something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now he's been like that a while now. He's 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 not himself sometimes. Uh, and uh, he gets into um, um, it, it's a war thing. Uh, don't blame don't blame them for being a, 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 a Agent Orange. Uh, so he's still affected by that because that's why my daughter's been looking after him, and he he ignores um, any help from anybody, and, and he just goes and does what he wants and and makes himself worse <coughs> for his health uh, instead of fixing his health up. Uh, but anyway, that's what she told me just uh, the other day. Um, uh, so uh, just uh, if he's not turning up, he didn't go up to the hui in Aramahoi. There was a hui in Aramahoi <coughs> uh, for Titifai and them, and uh, Hinefari and them. And uh, she, uh, uh, my daughter says, did you go? I said, no, no, I didn't go. I'm, I'm just going up to the one up to Hapua. She says, oh, oh okay. Then. Uh, so. That's that's the latest of 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 uh, how we are looking on the face of it. We've got a big audience watching us. We, we've got a we've got a massive audience watching us, uh, and uh, they they now can see uh, that there is a problem with this government. Uh, is is running the whole world from here? John Key and now Bill English got no idea. That's what Winston Peters said. Bill English has got no business idea of how to run a country. <clears throat> like John Key was a banker, you see, he knew how to make money and to, 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 to do things. And Helen Clark was similar, she knew how to talk, uh, talk it up uh, into the UN, put herself in there. Uh, now, now Bill English, he's, he's uh, dancing around as a Matai uh, from Samoa, and so it's made him vulnerable um, to any anything that he says because they're in the same legacy of, of one 
uh, committed this and the other one is is accessory to everything that's been going on uh, right back